ABC News is ready to project that Republicans will retain control of the House. Maybe not a surprise, but this is early, John Carl. Uh, this is not a surprise, uh, but you know, the Democrats needed just 25 seats. Republicans tonight could actually even pick up a seat or two. Now the big question becomes, what happens with Nancy Pelosi? She was the Speaker of the House. A lot of people expected her to retire when the Democrats lost control two years ago. She stayed on as minority leader to lead her party back to majority. That now has not happened. Does Nancy Pelosi stay in Congress? Boy, Koki, I remember the last time I interviewed uh, Nancy Pelosi, it sure seemed like she was setting up for retirement. Do you think I'm right? Well, it's the first female, only female Speaker of the House, and that was very important to her, talking about breaking the marble ceiling uh, of becoming that female Speaker. And I think she really wanted to stay long enough to fight to, to win it back. And uh, that clearly has not happened tonight. Now, it isn't a surprise by now, right. uh, but we were looking at a list of Republican freshmen who had come in with that Tea Party movement that, you know, was so strong a couple of years ago and who were from districts that were where they should have been quite vulnerable. And it looks like they've held on many of them and, to those seats. And, and Ron Brownstein, if you look at the congressional approval ratings, yeah. at times it dropped below 10 percent. Right. It's hard to get That's an approval rate. Right, right. Friends Family. should get you to that. No, <laughs> it, absolutely. And yet, and yet, as we continue to see most incumbents winning, and also this is a reminder of how personal rather than party-wide the case President Obama has made against Mitt Romney. I mean, he's made a case that Mitt Romney is someone you can't trust because of his background. He hasn't really made a very positive, strong case for democratic governance. And that's, I think, one reason why in, even in places where he's doing well, you don't see Democrats necessarily gaining in the House.